Blasmic versus Builder.io. Full comparison for developers and marketers. Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, we're comparing two powerful visual development platforms, Plasmic and Builder.io. If you're a developer looking for flexibility or a marketer focused on optimizing content visually, this comparison will help you decide which tool suits your workflow. Let's jump right in. Plasmic is best for design first, code ready components. First, it has the advanced design tool with pixel perfect design capabilities that rival Figma with real time responsiveness. Su is the code integration. It integrates directly with a framework like React, Next.js, and Vue for a developer friendly experience. Third, reusable components build and maintain consistent UI components across multiple projects. And a fourth is to CMS and headless integrations. Easily connects with headless CMS platforms like Sanity and Contentful, but it requires development into full potential. Best suited for teams that mix design and development. Second is limited no-code logic. Unlike web web, logic and workflows typically require custom coding, but it is still best for design-focused teams and development who need a flexible tool for creating stunning UI components with seamless code integrations for React and other frameworks. On the other hand, Builder.io is best for visual content management and marketing teams. Drag and Drop Visual Editor allows on non-technical users to edit content visually without developer input. It integrates with any framework, works with React, Vue, Angular, Shopify, and headless CMS platforms. It does also have a real-time collaboration, which enables live editing for teams, making it easy for marketers and developers to work together. With A over B testing and personalization, advanced features for optimizing user-friendly experience. It also limited custom code flexibility. Developers may find custom code integration less flexible than Plasmic. The pricing can be expensive for larger teams and enterprise features, but it's still best for marketers, content managers, and non-technical teams who want an intuitive way to create and manage web content without heavy developer involvement. Now let's dive into our final verdict. Use Plasmic if you're a developer who wants complete control over custom components, code, and seamless integration with modern web frameworks like React and Next.js. Use Builder.io if you're a marketer or content manager who needs an easy-to-use platform for visual editing like A and B testing and real-time collaboration without relying heavily on developers. Now, which platforms do you think will supercharge your next project? Let me know in the comments. I hope this breakdown made the choice between Plasmic and Builder.io clearer for you. If it helped, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more web development tips and tools. See you into the next one.